you make of this game and, and by that call by James Franklin? Yeah, well, starting with the game, Dwayne Haskins, Ohio State's quarterback, Heisman Trophy candidate, you know, he looked rattled for the first time this season through just his second interception of the season in the first half. Um, you know, got it together, obviously led the game-winning drive um, in the fourth quarter to put Ohio State up by one. And then, of course, Penn State can't convert on fourth and five. And after the game, James Franklin took complete blame uh, for the call. Um, you know, they saw that Penn State's defense um, made a couple shifts, so they, they called two timeouts, and then they just couldn't execute on the play. And, um, you know, he was really honest in the post-game press conference. He shouldered all the blame. He said, you know, this team has been was average, went to average, to good, to great. And right now, they're stuck in great, and they are not an elite team like Ohio State. But he vowed to get this team to that level. Um, he was very strong in that statement. Yeah, a tough loss there for a Penn State team in a very competitive Big Ten and a very competitive national landscape. Is there a way now moving forward for the Nittany Lions to make the playoff? I think so. You know, all they all they got to do, see, right. it sounds easier <laughs> easier said than done, um, is win the rest of their games. It's kind of like a Georgia-Alabama situation last year um, where Alabama had that one loss to Auburn and still uh, made the college football playoff. Um, you know, if the college football selection committee looks at Penn State at the very end of the season and they see this one loss, it's a really good one loss uh, by one point to Ohio State, and assuming Ohio State goes on to win the Big Ten. Um, right now, looking at the landscape, it's definitely the best one loss in all of uh, college football.